Hey everybody, Aaron here from My Turbo Reviews, back for another Generation 1 Generations comparison video. This will be the last video like this, at least for a while, because this is the last bit that I have to pack away before I move to my new place. I'm going to start with the Decepticons today, because I didn't have any at all um, in my previous video. So, we have G1 Thrust and Generations Thrust. G1 Dirge and Generations Dirge. Yes, I know G1 Dirge is missing a few stickers. Um, I don't know why. It could be that I just didn't apply them back in 1985 when I got them. Then we move on to the Autobots. First we have G1 Red Alert. And yes, I know he is a little bit yellowed. Unfortunately, in the 80s, I had my Transformers displayed near a window with no curtains. And I didn't know anything at the, at the time about sun damage. Uh, but then we have Generations Red Alert. Then finally, G1 Blur and his Generations counterpart. Now... These two guys are the most dissimilar out of all the ones that I've shown so far. And that's largely due to the fact that the mold used for Generations Blur uh, was originally intended for Generations Drift. And it was just recolored and slightly remolded into a Blur character. I imagine had they gone for... An original mold for the character it would look more like his G1 counterpart. Alright, so that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, my little comparison videos. Hopefully I'll do more after I get settled in my new place. But uh, until then, keep watching for little videos and um, I hope to be back up in about a month doing reviews and stuff. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.